The first major winter storm of 2016 hit the eastern part of the country. Murfreesboro's street superintendent reflects on how his department dealt with it. Once Friday's snowstorm came, you know, it, it came quick. It, uh, you know, we noticed that, you know, that rain changing over the snow just happened in just, a, you know, just a few minutes. Uh, the city currently is only able to put salt down. You know, we've, we are working on another program, a brine program here uh, in, in the process of purchasing some of that equipment and the tools to be able to put brine down before a snow. But, you know, brine's only, only good if it doesn't wash away before it changes over. This came in as rain, so there wasn't really anything we could do until it changed over to snow. But once it changed, changed over to snow, uh, we immediately uh, already, had, uh, already had our trucks lined up, two men per truck. And six trucks is what we run. They all have six routes, and they immediately went to work, started placing uh, salt down and, and salting their entire route. Well, they would work 12 hours, so they worked from 7 in the morning until 7 that evening. And then the other 12 came in and worked another 12-hour cycle doing the same thing. And we did that for about 48 hours. You know, what most people don't know that the guys and gals that, that work here I mean, they are willing to do whatever it takes to get the job done, and that's why I'm, I'm just so proud of every one of them. Uh, we have a, a unique mixture of people here, uh, which was, was kind of neat to see some of the older hands that have been here for several years and you know, be able to kind of take the younger ones that we've just hired, because we've hired probably 10 new people in the last couple of years, and you know, they've not been around snow or driving this kind of weather but it was neat to see and we kind of paired those we kind of paired those up that way too knowing it that kind of the older teaching the younger you know we've got a, a also a mixture of vehicles we've got a couple of new vehicles and we've got several old vehicles well you know some of the older vehicles when you run them 48 hours straight it's you know stressful on a vehicle and we've had a few breakdowns but you know with the help of uh, fleet service and uh, the talent that uh, our employees have here was able to keep them going and keep them on the road. The best thing people can do is if, if they see a salt truck coming down the road is to try to get as far out of the way as they can and, and let the salt truck through. Uh, we were able to get out ahead of the storm and, and do as much as we could in preparing for the, the coming of it, but residents did did great and uh, you know if they could stay home we do appreciate it. If they see a truck coming, if they could move over, that would be perfect. 